Big T, the million dollar hook, man. We're gonna tell you how I got that name. DJ Flip. RIP first, man. The Big Hawk, Fat Pat, yes, Little Will. You know, all the players get that song, man. But, uh, let's go. DJ, let's, let me show up you know, how I got the thing. Yeah. Hey. 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 Down, man, say face live, man. You know, it's Stu Crew, man. Stu the world.com, Stu Radio. Sheesh, man. When you come to the zoo, you're gonna guarantee to sweat, man. <laughs> Richard Pounder in the building, you already know. Who's 0017? We're kicking it with StuTheWorld.com. Let me go check them out, you know what I'm saying? We're at the zoo, you heard? You already know, yeah, we're getting it in, yeah. We're on the lookout, I see them coming. Yeah. Pounding these yeah. bitches. Yeah, boy, man, it's yeah. up though. Follow me on Instagram, Richard Pounder. <laughs> What's good? It's your boy Faze Aureli Bambino. We out here at the Stu Zoo, Big Ticket Management. I'm with Sly That Guy. Oh, you know shit. what time it is. Who's that guy? Taking over 2017. Y'all come fuck with me June 30th. I'm in H-Town with Zero. Yeah, holla at me on IG, P-H-A-Z-E-R-E-L-L-I-E. -L -L -E. Facebook, Google, YouTube, it's all the same. Fuck with me. Slide that guy in this bitch. Kicking it with my nigga Faze. Y'all already know what it is, man. The butter clouds where I stay, but it's more store, y'all niggas already know. Yeah, yeah. Follow me, find me, man. We got more, man. Look out, man. Watch that new breed shit and all that cool shit, man. It's all the same. Slide that guy, my nigga. Fuck with your boy. Shouts out to Stu. So with it, it's your boy JD, man. You know what I'm saying? Getting down with Gorilla Bread, you know what I'm saying? Getting down with my boy Stu. Wait no little flip, you know what I'm saying? Just came through to show love. I ain't, I ain't performing tonight, I'm just coming to show love, man. So shout out to Stu, shout out to, you know what I'm saying, my boy Lil' One, you know what I'm saying, Gorilla Bread, you know what I'm talking about? It's going down, squared entertainment, JD, you know what I'm saying, represent Texas, man, I already. I always say he want to hear I can do that, let's get it. Let's get it. Thank you for coming out, man. That's A1, for real. But uh, let's go ahead and get into a few of these questions, bro. So, first of 
First of all, you know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and start from the very, very jump, bro. You from uh, Houston, Southside, correct? South, South, Clover, Land of the exact. What was going on? What was happening when you got crowned the Freestyle King? Well, I pretty much bumped into screw, like, you know, I, I battled, right? So I did a whole bunch of rap battles and shit. Then, you know, I'm always affiliated with the street cast because, you know, that's where we come from, the streets. So, you know, being in the right places at the right times, freestyling, and he would bump into me like, dog, you go hard. And when I first met him, he was like, man, freestyle. If you can freestyle, freestyle right now. So, you know, I freestyled about what he was wearing, him and Mike B. And, you know, I just, I was always the type of person, like, if I'm, I'm going to do something I'm serious about it, you don't have to call me to let me know when your next event is, because if I'm trying to be there, I'm going to call you. So I, I asked Screw, I'm like, let me know where all your events at. If I'm open, I'm coming. And so, you know, when he has something, I show up, you know, pull up, and I watched him, like, sell shitloads of, like, tapes. Like, go to car shows with, like, 10,000 tapes and leave the car show with n no tapes. And I had to help him count the money. So I'm like, shit, we, we count, like, 100 grand and 80 Ks and shit. Like, I'm like, I'm like, well, I, I'm going to uh, do the street shit, but shit, I'm going to do this music shit. And so that's where we at with it. We just kept it. We hustle. Right? It's like we hustle in the streets. I use that same, you know, uh, mind frame. Now, 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 there's an infamous video. Yeah. That goes around, you know what I'm saying? Where you at the party with, with Screw and everything. Is that exactly where it happened, where he actually grabbed you? Right, right. That was at uh, Club Connections. It was on St. Patrick's Day, which we like to call Clover Day. Oh. He did. So he grabbed me the Freestyle King of the Screwed Up Click. And you know, I'm the youngest in the Screwed Up Click. So, you know, I sat back and watched everybody do their thing, you know, and I, I just took notes. You know what I'm saying? I took notes. I toured with ESG. I toured with Kiki. You know what I'm saying? I toured with Big Mo, rest in peace. You know, before Big Mo died, we was going to do the group called White Cup Game. You know what I'm saying? Oh, oh. But, so, you know, but we still holding it down for the White Cup Game. So, you know, I'm keeping the movement alive, man. Absolutely. Absolutely, man. So, as far as the, the body boys, everything good? Everything oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I was talking to Cino probably like a week ago. Like, a lot of times... We, we talk about life, you know, a lot of times people just be like, man, we y'all gonna do the song, we y'all gonna do a new song, like, we just did one on the 713 Degrees in Houston, uh, but we talk about, you know, what's going on, family shit, you know what I mean? And, and you know what, it feels good to see somebody just keep it real with the people that they came in with, bro. Well, you know, I'm from Texas, so I gotta keep it true. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, so what's up, man? We got what? How many? How many albums we looking at now? What? Sold or recorded? <laughs> <laughs> well, shit. Let's go song. You know, I want to stun on over twenty-two million. I yeah, got yeah, it. yeah, yeah. We're like twenty-seven million now. Twenty-seven Sheesh. million albums. Uh, Twelve. We almost at thirteen million ringtones. So you know, we we still working. Still working. God damn, what do the, now do the, do the, we, I want to kind of flip this into a little educational thing. You know what I'm saying? Whenever, Message. whenever, whenever do you, you go platinum, do they, do they dress it up and make it real for you? Do they just, you know what I'm saying, have a party or do they just ship it to you? How do they present that to you? If you, if you sign the wrong deal, you don't get shit. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but we had parties and shit, man, you know, um. I mean, the whole office was happy, man. Like, we, we did some shit, you know, that, that people didn't think could be done. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't know. You drop a double album, it counts as two sales. Yeah, yeah. School them, Flip. Yeah. School them. So school them. You drop an album, and it's a double. You sell 250000 it counts as two. So you go. But shit, we still sold a million records, the real million records. The real way. And got to the two million and the three million and shit like that. Uh, and that's all paperwork straight, everything lined up. So you touching all kind of bread and that's what's up, man. So, so, so real quick before we get you to perform, bro, I really kind of wanted to touch on your book while we was talking really, you know what I'm saying, on that educational stuff. Really, what's the, what's the name of your book? Don't Let the Music Industry Fool You. Don't let the music industry fool you. That's deep, bro. Hey, man, I mean, you know, I, I feel like with this music shit, 
You know, you can get on the mic and talk a whole bunch of flaws and shit, but I feel like at the same time, if you go make music like that, you also gotta put a message in it. You know what I'm saying? So I, that's why like 85% of my albums be street shit. And then, you know, then I put a couple records for the ladies and I do some, you know, flaws and shit, but I like telling you what the fuck I'm going through. You know what I'm saying? Oh, shit like that heartfelt shit. You know, I started Underground Legend off with what I've been through. I had over three million fans come to me in the streets and say, man, I heard that motherfucking song, I should have listened, you got me through this. You know what I'm saying? Oh. I got parents that come up to me and say, I made my kids listen to I should have listened. <laughs> Classic freestyle. Yeah, yeah. Wanna be a
Yeah, 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 yeah